Silver Rat Talos. What do we want to use against Silver Rat Talos? I decide I'm going to try the Great Sword. A basil geese. A sluggish brute. Fierce, but foolish. Challenging the king. Its graceful wings, drawing a silver arch in the sky. In a flash, the tables turn. Stay aground and curse your fate. Whilst your body is consumed by flame. Argent Emperor. Dude, Basil Geese, I'm sorry, man. Yeah, these cutscenes are great. Give me that Aurortal. I just figured, you know, dragon, my knight outfit with the sword, it just, it just fits. Oh, and I can put him to sleep. A wake up attack with the great sword. That's always good. My, my plan here is to not be too greedy. I'm just going to take hits that I can. Okay. That's weak sauce damage right there. Whoa. He's just going ham. Nice one. Jesus. Of course. I got the parry, but he had another attack coming. There we go. Alright, he's angry. Whoa. That is terrifying. Let's see if I mess this up. No! Oh. Son of a gun. You're kidding me. Dude, this is wild. All right. Of course, I messed up my wake up attack. Oh. 
Oh, that's what I'm talking about, boys. 994 off of Rage Slash. That is definitely what we're talking about. And the knockdown. Mm. I know I'm not getting big damage off his face, but I kind of want to break it. Not too bad. Oh, yeah. Crud. Wow, that was a quick roar. Let's just heal up. Ooh. Unless that wasn't so big. That was man close, so uh... there it goes. I knew it was going to come soon. That was risky. That was mildly terrifying. That's the first time he's done that junk. You're kidding me. <laughs> The great sword's like one of the most satisfying weapons, but also the most painful when junk like that happens. Out of the air, really? I just can't get a knockdown for the life of me. Or I mean like a mount. So I'm trying to get a mount on him. Before I kill him.
Yo. What's the guy gotta do to get a mount? Forget about it, man. I just can't get the mount for the life of me. Slice his ankles off. That is one thing about using the strong arm stance, which is the counter. Is it can be hard to get mounts. I mean, unless you really land the counter a lot, but using the surge slash combo, which is this, makes it harder to land the counters. I love using the surge slash combo. So it's like, do you want to use surge slash combo? Or do you want to use a uh, strong arm counter? I like both. Of the two, I like Rathalos. I mean, I always like Rathalos better than Rathian personally, but of the between gold and silver, I definitely like silver Rathalos better because like his fire breathing and stuff just looks so cool. I know Rathian's, it looks similar, but he, the Rathian's more about the tail swipes. They both each, like, have some of the other person's stuff. But Rathalos' thing is clearly fire breathing is, like, his main thing. And I, I like that better than the tail swipes. It just looks cooler. I'm having a tough time deciding if I want to use... The Jack... Homage or Hammer. Good job taking care of those rats, yeah. Everyone was pleased with how you handled it. Well, almost everyone. Bahari was a little upset that he didn't get a chance to observe him out in the wild. Eh? I mean, I know his research is important, yeah, but barbecued Bahari doesn't sound very appetizing, does it? Either way, we're getting closer to solving our little monster problems. Just one got one left to deal with, and you're going to have a lot of fun with this one, too. Ever dealt with a lucid Nargatuga before? A long time ago, yes. Well, you're in for a treat. Incredible power and speed pl puts the normal variety to shame, and it's got this disappearing act. You'll see, or not. Either way, hunting it, it is going to require mastery over your senses. It's going to test you at every turn. If there's anyone that can defeat this beast, it's you. Just remember everything that master of yours taught you, yeah. Well, then you know what to do. But do us a favor, yeah? He says yeah too much. Come back in one piece. We still need you around here. An assassin, how frightening. Hey, Red, an urgent quest has come in. The target, Elucid Nargatuga. Its speed is fearsome enough, but the ability to disappear in moonlight makes it awfully daunting. It never comes out in daytime, so your only hope is to face it on its own terms. That being said, I have a complete faith in your ability to handle the task of Redden. All of us will wait here for your safe return. I don't know, part of me just wants to use my lance. But then the other part of me wants to use the switch axe with my Mad World attire. But then another part of me wants to use the hammer. I'm not live, so you guys can't help me choose. I don't know, I'm kind of feeling the switch axe, I think. Let's just go for it, because I like the idea, you know. The Forlorn Arena is where we're fighting them, I believe. And then... Okay, here we go. Beneath the brightly shining moon. It does not merely bask in the light, but absorbs the moon's brilliance and uses it as a veil. And with unmatched speed, death comes swiftly, an elegant and gracious form, never witnessed by its prey. Moonlit Shadow. All right, wow, this looks cool. It didn't look like this when I was fighting the... Rathian and Rathalos. Did it? I guess sonic bombs are useful against it. All right, let's see how this goes, man. I know it can poison me. And junk. Oh, there he is.
Dang, he went for Squire instead of me. Heal just to be safe. I really want to try going for a grind, but I am going for it. Break this arm. Oh, not very good damage. That's a straight up Beyblade attack right there. Here comes the poison. Oh, get away, get away. It's gonna make it rain. This is a bad idea. Cancel it, cancel it. Quick. I know that's, that doesn't really sound like me canceling the chains. Oh, is that gonna keep moving out? Oh God, how, how wide does it get? Okay. Oh, nice. Let's grind up the tail. Kobe and I both mounted him. <laughs> Tight. Yeah. Oops. He's poisoning up. What? A okay, whetstone. We really need the whetstone real quick. Whetstone again. Let's see if I can get this. Uh... There we go. That's not bad. Oh, 
Oh my god. I don't know if you guys saw me squint. I thought I was dead there. I, I wire bugged and he went for a second one. And I was like, if that hits me, I thought I was done. What's he doing? Oh my god, there's the Beyblade. Okay, break this arm. And you know what? Let's grind up the tail, too. Why not? Nice try, punk. I kept my eyes on you. The key is to look him in the eyes. Ooh. There's some damage, dude. Why are we not able to mount him? Uh oh, oh. Speak of the devil. Gotta see his moves. Dang. Pretty wild. Usual leap. Alright. Well, there's Lucent Mar Nargakuga's moves. Oh, and it puts Thunderblade on him? That's what I'm talking about. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. I was trying to... Trying to get the stun. Man, I ran out of juice. I really wanted to counter that, but I ran out of juice. Okay, all that's left is his tail. God, get your fat arm out of the way, scumbag. Oh god, okay, here we go.
Oh, yes. That was tight. Get wrecked, Lucinaga Kuga. Yo, we nailed it. That was great. I was just saying how I wanted to counter it, but I ran out of juice earlier. And then that's how we finish it. Getting what I wanted. I didn't get to grind them up, but I'll just consider that grinding them up. I mean, he came down with the tail slam. I did like a spinning explosion slash. That was so sick, man. Like he, he came in over the top with that slow tail slam. That's a really fun fight, I have to say. I kind of like, so this is a rare occasion where I kind of like using something other than the lance in, in a fight because for some, for some reason this fight is really fun when you're both just like jumping around, you know what I mean? It's like really, really fast paced. Although, because with the lance while he was cloaked, I'd just sit there with the shield up, you know? There's no real danger whatsoever. But, you know, keeping your eyes on him and then dodging or parrying, like, right when he comes down over the top. I don't know. That was a lot of fun. Enjoyed that quite a bit. You can't even tell what's happening in that. <laughs> but you see his tail landing and you see a bunch of explosions because me parrying it. That was so cool. I love that. Let's take a look. Let's just start at the bottom. Pride. Oh, that's the base seething basil geese. All right. What you'd expect. It's got... Oh, it has guts. Guts is back. <laughs> that's pretty nice. When vitality is 64 or higher. Okay. Golden loon. <laughs> Too gaudy. You know, that's the thing. That's the problem. To, it's just Rathian armor, but gold, obviously. Oh, the silver Rathalos. I love the hue of it, but... And it's like an iconic armor set, but it's not one that I'd want to use, like, as my character. I didn't really look at the perks for... Well, Jesus. Some of these have a ton of perks. The golden Rathian has a ton of perks. Or skills, or whatever. Perfectly timed evade just as monster attacks to trigger abnormal status buildup on hit. Huh. Or a increases attack power and affinity when attacking a large monster. So this is for like if you're using like sleep weapon or paralysis weapon or any elemental weapon. That's what this armor sets for, without a doubt. Defiance. Increased defense when large monsters become enraged. What? Level 5 nullifies weak, strong, and powerful roars, wind and dragon wind, and tremors, and defense plus 30 while they're enraged. Good grief. So when they're enraged, you're enraged. I like that perk a lot. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Silver soul. Nothing crazy like that. It's all stuff that we've seen before. But still really good elemental. It's all elemental stuff. Lucinaga Kuga. Sneak attack. What's that? Increases damage to large monsters when attacks hit from them from behind. So if you're going for the tail or something like that, you'll be doing a lot more damage. I usually like going for the face unless I'm specifically trying to cut off the tail, though. Adrenaline rush. Form a perfectly timed evade just as monster attacks for a temporary attack boost. So perfectly timed evades and stuff are the key here. Interesting stuff. Let's take a look at the armor. Yikes. But it's just what you'd expect from Nargakuga, you know. Oh, the Palico Seething Basil Geese is pretty cool. Oh, they, they don't have gold. Oh, you guys didn't see me fight that. This is probably going to come out before you see me fight Valstrax, honestly. Um, but I had, spoiler alert, I fought Valstrax when I got to, like, Hunter rank 50, I think. Or was it 70? I think it was 70. So, yeah, there you go. Interesting seething basil geese gets armor for them, but not maybe it's just near Ew oh, Wait, there's more to it Good work out there. I had little doubt you'd get it done, but you never know especially considering what you were dealing with 
Your master would be proud, and now that you've come back with all your bones in the right spots, we can celebrate, yeah? But as much as I'd love to think that Parade of Awful Monsters was the last of it, the world isn't so kind. Gallius and Fiorain have their hands full with those afflicted monsters. Elgato is going to need all the backup it can get. Still, there wouldn't be an Elgato to get back to without your help. Much appreciated, yeah. Okay, no, that is it. So now I'm back to just grinding for Master Rank 100. Where are we now that we did all that? 85. So we got 15 to go. Not too bad, so you'll probably be seeing that shortly. And then after that... Next thing on the docket is wait for another update. But thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope you had fun seeing those monsters. I had a whole lot of fun fighting them, to be honest. I love the new arena. It just looks cool, especially during the Lucent. That was the highlight. The Lucent Nargakuga fight was a lot of fun. I'm glad I picked the Switch Axe, although the hammer would have been fun too. But something about the Switch Axe was just a lot of fun in that fight. So, you know, grinding up the tail. Watching him when he's cloaked. I don't know. I had a blast with that. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. I look forward to the next update. And I'll see you when I reach Master Rank 100.